Hello and welcome to another episode of Corpse Party. I'm Bring Stabity, the stabbiest stabby that ever stabbied. And with me is N. Weissmuller, who uh, sincerely regrets the sad fate of Yui. Yeah, she did not go out at all well. She went out like a hero, but it was not pretty. Anyway. Let's get control back into Corpse Party. Resume at the save. And Enwise, the controls are yours. Let's continue heading downstairs. Speaking of pretty, who do you think's uh, cutest? Ayomi, Naomi, or Seiko? Seiko. I'm uh, hard to uh, debate that too much, but... <laughs> uh so tomato d tomato asked another one died answer is it appears so um well the teacher got a uh, heavy cabinet full of uh sharp objects crashed down on top of her pushed into her and broke her legs and rib cage and then she lost consciousness. And if she survived that, that is some sort of bullshit right there. There we go. There's your answer, Tomato. <laughs> so yes, so far we've lost Seiko and we've probably lost the teacher. And I guess technically at the bad end, uh, uh, Yoshiki died, but that was just not... the bad end. And we're not on that route yet. So let's head north. We already grabbed the uh, stupid oh. IDs from these corpses. Uh, basically, all four of these got shanked by uh, someone with knives. Pretty much. Or who knows, maybe it was a hatchet. Something sharp. <laughs> yeah. How the fuck you'll survive when your legs and rib cage is broken and you don't have medical treatment immediately? Yeah, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Survival is incredibly oh. unlikely. Basically, we're pretty sure she's dead. We just haven't explicitly found the corpse yet. Exactly. Yes. What are you doing? Go Um, uh, we do need to re-grab the victim's memoirs, but... And it will let Tomato see it anyhow. Sure, fair enough. Since Tomato's here, we can redo it. I ate my friend today. What else was I supposed to do? I was starving. We both were, and there's no food here. So we decided, together that one of us should try to live just a little bit longer. If I ever get home, I'm supposed to tell all the people waiting for us what happened. We left it all up to a game of paper, scissors, rock. Loser eats winner. That is a great detail, isn't it? It's the yeah. loser who... <laughs> it's the loser who has to eat. And I lost. I felt her blood going down my throat, quenching my thirst. And her meat was supple and satisfying. But that blood and that meat was once my friend. Up until just a few hours before, I'd been talking with her. As I feasted, I just kept thinking, this food used to be a person. 
Before I tore it apart, it all worked together to sustain a life. And every time I thought about that, I just started crying, and I couldn't stop. I wanted some part of her to be with me even after she died, so I decided to keep one of her eyeballs. And I thought maybe I should write all of this down to help preserve some small portion of my sanity. You're carrying her eyeball around. That ship has sailed. <laughs> yes, it has. Yes, it has. There are decaying skeletal, skeletal remains of a middle school student. They're in the process of slowly drying and whitening, creating an almost overpowering stench throughout the hallway. Any clothing the deceased had been wearing is long gone, so there are no means of readily identifying gender on site. Yeah. I'll leave that one to you, Enwes. Basement. The door has been nailed shut and is unlikely to be opened. Do not allow any person to enter. Takamine Yanakibori, principal of Tenjin Elementary School, which is to say heavenly host. Yep. Heaven people. <laughs> And we need to break our stone again, right? Yes, we will. She is not okay. Really shouldn't. Not a good idea to be here. There is, and you need it. It's a ghost! In this time, the hinting is absolutely correct. <laughs> as opposed to that one room where... Yeah. Anyway, we need to talk to him. Yeah, that's normally good advice, but we actually do need to ignore it. What? The power stone in Yoshiki's pocket suddenly and spontaneously shattered. Yes? Yes, you did save us, Miss Yui. Power stone saved us. Anyway, uh, before you can... No, 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 no. Go back. Go back to where you were standing. Go back to where you were standing. Uh, Up two spaces. Where? And look down. Or go down one space. Perfect. Okay, and this is the scene option that we select if we uh, did not choose to speak to the ghost a second time and get a bad ending. So, let's uh, head down, grab the item, and continue on. A rusted, blood-soaked nail puller is sitting on top of the desk. Take it. Yes! <laughs> Acquired nail puller. Ooh. It's a plain rusted nail puller made of iron. I have to say, classroom 4A seems like it would barely function as a classroom with this layout. Uh-huh. Yeah. It's definitely a messed up classroom. Alright. Oh, we have a nail puller. Nah, but, yeah. doesn't seem to be good enough. Let's check the uh, east side of the hallway. Hey, you wrong send some well wishes to Tomato. Door seems affixed to the wall like a bottle. It can't be opened. It won't open. It won't open.
based on the long strands of ha hair scattered all around. These are likely the remains of a female student. There's a hastily written note on the ground. Its writer seems to have struggled with it as the lettering is inconsistent and difficult to read. Why, sister? It hurts! It hurts! After I die, the pain will continue forever! No. <laughs> You're wrong, that's so bad. He's talking to Tomato. I would say eat soup, but you might have lost relatives that way, Tomato. <laughs> no, 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 no! I will never forgive you. Um, wasn't that corpse uh, in just the same place where we found the found the guide? The pretty, the, yep. Yeah, with the pretty lengthy set of. Alright, well, okay. it's not given anything particularly useful or bad. Stodian's closet. The door is locked. Alright. We gotta head back. There's an erratic noise like that of TV static coming from it. So this may be a right. malicious ghost, but on the other hand, she's a malicious ghost who... Malicious, really but not paying... malignant. Well, not really paying attention to us, so yay. Yeah. All right, let's head back south. Uh-oh. <laughs> it's a zombie! Okay, uh, very important. Do not go uh, into the uh, entryway. Uh, we want to go uh, activate. So yeah, let's uh, head back to uh, room one or one A. Sadly, we uh, can't save here. Actually, you know, we may as well try, but I don't think it'll let us. Any, uh, by the way, what happens if you step on the area on the floor that's already broken? Uh, not sure. We can check on the way back. Yeah, let's head to uh, classroom 1A. You mean like uh, what we're facing into? Yeah. Is that what? I guess so. It just... Uh doesn't let you go. There's no fall fall deaths except when required. Oh. So we go back into 1A? I Yeah, to... I I actually messed this up. Hang on, sorry. Can you go back to the first floor, go back to the fork? I'm going to have to do a little bit of stitching, assuming I remember. But I definitely should. Fork uh, I'm hungry. <laughs> <laughs> so you said important, don't go into the entry, but actually we should no. go into the entry? No. We want to stop right right here. Perfect. Okay, decision time. Uh, if, if we go south and follow after Ayumi, we'll be on the good path. But uh, first, if you want to instead continue on the story without her will be on the bad ending. So, be sure to make your choice. First option, continue on without her. Option two, uh, go after Ayumi. Make your pick. Okay, we are going to choose to go uh, left and not grab Ayumi because we're heading towards one of the bad endings. And I need to make a mental note to cut out the previous uh, little thing here we did. 
All right. We got to go to classroom 1A. And uh, put that no. nail puller to good use. The door is nailed shut, and the nails are hammered in tight. It's not going to open through any normal means. Use the nail puller? Yeah! So now we're going to use abnormal means. <laughs> so you're going to take all the bad endings first, then the good endings. Correct, Tomato. That is the game plan. Although successful in loosening every nail and opening the door, the rusted old nail puller broke apart in the process. Aww. Um, and seeing how it was designed, that must have been some pretty freaking bad rust. Yes, it must have been. There's a piece of scrap paper pinned to the wall. You notice dark spots dotting the page and realize they're tear stains. Those who choose to ignore the darkness that dwells in the hearts of man may be stuck forever in a loop. For in this world, there are some truths that simply must be known, no matter how disturbing. But curiosity can be deadly, and other truths are best left untold. Beware the messages of the dead, for there be curses among them, curses that can crush even the strongest wills, demolishing all semblance of reason. Yeah, like the victim's memoirs. If you wish to protect your sanity, take heed. Do not let your curiosity get the better of you. Do not read the victim's memoirs to their conclusion. Okay. Anyway, let's uh, operate this device. Control mechanism. For some sort of elaborate pulley system, rigged up with a network of fine, virtually transparent threads. There's a lever jutting out from one side. Pull it. Let's pull do it. Pull that lever. Pull the lever. Kronk, pull the lever. And that is our next destination. Back to classroom 4A. By the way, what happened to uh, Takashi's sister? I think you mean Satoshi's sister. Uh, did she die? We have not seen her yet, so we don't know what happened to her. If we're very, very lucky, maybe she died. <laughs> Let's just say uh, neither of us really are fans of her. Yuka is definitely the worst girl here. As we shall see. Yes, as we shall. All right. Once more, Kronk, pull the lever! Kathunk? Click, 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 click. <laughs> okay, uh, let's uh, head out and uh, see what kind of damage we may have just caused. Although, it's pretty obvious what those nearly transparent wires did to her. Yeah! Shinozaki? She's half the girl she used to be. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. 
やだなんだよ<笑>なんなんだよなんでこんな目に遭わなきゃいけねえんだなんでお前の尻顔なんか見なきゃいけねえんだよふざけんなよ塩ザギお前の<笑>そんな姿見るくらいなら俺が代わりに死ねばよかったんだ Well, we can't do instead, but we can do in addition. <laughs> so. Anyway, Tomato said she got the Gojo treatment. <coughs> I'm not familiar with Gojo. Do tell. Thump. Well, that's not great. Not at all, but once again, the sound design on this thing. It's like so. so disgustingly good. Anyway, my controls, n w i s e Ending list, chapter two. We got wrong end number two. Ending. Body bisected by wire trap. GG c h e Uh, JJK Gojo didn't read the manga. No. I have no idea what you're even referencing, Tomato. I'm sorry. But yeah, that is the second bad ending、uh, claimed. We still have two more bad endings and the good ending to go. But for now, that is it for this episode. Please like, follow, subscribe. Check me out on Twitch, YouTube, Rumble, Odyssey, and Kick. Free money in the description, and I will see you guys. In the next part. Bye now.